Hi, this is Natasha. I wanted to share with you the cards that I made on Ustream tonight. Um, I had an opportunity to do a little deep cleaning in my office and I found a couple of things that either have just slipped my mind or slipped my desk. I found a couple of things in between my desk and a cabinet. So needless to say, um, I didn't want to toss uh, everything that I found so I thought I would utilize them and make some cards. So the this card was inspired by the beautiful background image. It was actually a card that I had received in one of the swaps that um, I hosted and I just couldn't bring myself to throw out the card. It was just really pretty. It was a, one of those mass-produced cards but it was a really lovely image so it wasn't handy and I did leave, save the um, backside with the sentiment but I thought I could repurpose it so what I did is I added a layer of one of the pages from the Glitz French Kiss uh, six by six stack that I just got and it's this particular one the one with all the browns and rust colors which matched perfectly to the background image and then I used um, three rosettes from the making memories trim and as you can see I stickled all of the edges with glit with um, crystal stickles right there because it has a green undertone and the green sparkle and that was picked up nicely on the there you go on the images and the mini um, dress form die a uh, little bit of uh, some trim that I have that's um, um, measuring tape uh, one of my little shrunken there you go shrunken uh, or shrunk up little dress forms a few sweetheart blooms from Wild Darker Crafts also um, with stickles. So now I have a cute little card. And then the second thing that I found was the stamped image on matte uh, photo paper. And I also found this trim that I had I totally forgot about. So what I did is I mounted it on cardstock and then put on dimensionals and wove the trim as though it's growing from the vine there. And then with my Dymo labeler just spelled out grow where you're planted. Because I wanted to use a stamp, where is it, that I just got from one of the girls from uh, ETC Swap. But unfortunately this was too wide for the space that I had, but I loved the sentiment, so I just did it in Dymo. And just on craft. And it matches the green scrapalope that I made the other day. So, oh, focus. So, here you go, two of them, and then one more quick share. Um... I showed, I shared the distress markers that I got today from all my crafts and I colored up this image from Stamper's Best using um, Barn Door and a couple of the greens. So just a quick little coloring up. So there you go. I'll have close-up photographs on my blog, but probably not until tomorrow because um, I'd, I'd prefer to take photographs in the daylight and it's already dark here from today so if you have any questions about any of the products that I used please leave me a comment and I'll include a link to my Ustream which I periodically pop on to over um, after work in order to release some of my stresses so uh, I'll give you a sneak peek of something else that I'm working on I might work on tomorrow and Zelda might recognize this she sent this to me from uh, Australia along with these puffy paints so I'm working on a little tag for her so there you go stop by um, I might actually do an entire you stream tomorrow for Friday fun bits so stay tuned thanks for watching everyone